Hannah Ewing, Curatorial Assistant and Graphic Designer for M765. Welcome to our online exhibition. This week we're going to be focusing on water in the Memphis area, specifically the Memphis Aquifer. I'd also like to introduce one of our artists, Maisie Craddock, whose beautiful art provokes thoughts about the vulnerability of nature and our intimate relationship with it. I started working with landscape about eight years ago, and to me it is more than a subject. It's really um, combined with the way I work in the studio. It's just, it's a, it's a very spiritual practice for me. Um, the, the work, the, the method and materiality that I have developed in the studio with this like incredibly complicated, laborious process is a way for me to interpret what I'm seeing outside. And I'm interested, not in the portrait, I don't, I'm not really interested in, in um, how how to interpret a person, a personality. I'm, I've seen abstract work that I absolutely am floored by. I don't know how to make that stuff. Um, I've seen conceptual work that has really blown my mind, but that, that's not how I see the world. So this is, this is what I can offer, and this is what I can be true to. And it's just being um, aware of what's happening in the world around me. Um, I happen to live in the south and on the edge of a city, and I, my studio is on the edge. I'm seeing a lot of abandonment and ruin. Um, but I take this, these images and ideas back into the studio and find a way to um, re, reintroduce them or interpret them through all of this material. And the sewing, the painting, the drawing, the line. Um, that's what I do. If you are interested in helping protect our aquifer, there are a few ways you can get involved. The easiest is to show people you care. Spread the word about what the aquifer is and how important it is in our community. Be observant. Look for ways the aquifer could be put in danger and reach out to someone who could help. Be cautious of how much water you're using and if possible, try to change your lifestyle. If you're looking for a more hands-on opportunity, Protect Our Aquifer has more information on their website. Check out the link to get started. Thank you for listening, and we hope you enjoy this week's topic on water.